Hi everyone, how are you? Good morning, good evening, good night, whatever you are. I hope that the conversation between I and um uh, in the blog was useful for you so you could be um, aligned with what we are going to work today. So remember that uh, each day I will try, sorry, I will try to do it each day. Um, uh, I will try each day to uh, to write this, but um, remember that each day I go to the pyramids, I kind of download the information and uh, uh, I translate that vibration in this conversation between the I and the am. Uh, so it's just for you to have this um, information uh, so you can be connected to, to the meditation that we do every night at this time. So remember that everything that we are doing each day, you can find it in uh, the blog, which is yosoy.red. Okay, red. It's not the color. Red in Spanish means network. So we are all ready. So today we have to work with the heart. So let's go to the information of today. Remember, we are still in the first month, which is the first cycle called whole lack. Remember that along this whole month relate to the constellation of Leo, which means that we are going to work with the aspect of the I am related to the constellation of Leo, which is I can. The vibration with which we are going to work today in relation with the heart is the vibration me. So according to the ancient way of seeing the vibration, the M is related with the portal, the door, and E, the sound E, that you may say I, the sound E is um, the balance, the, yeah, the balance itself. This is because it is related with the door of the heart in between the balance that represents the arms and the um, hands. The statement for today is I am the portal of the heart. And the code of the day is the inspiration uh, related to the process of experimentation. We have to remember that there are four uh, stages of um, four stages of the um, of the time, which is expression, experimentation, integration, and transcendence. Each one of these four has a process of three that they themselves have to be expressing. These three processes are inspiration, contemplation, and exhalation. This gives us 12 steps. So this is why we are going to be working with uh, concepts of 12, uh, a package of 12 concepts that we are going to work along the whole year. So the code in English, it is inhaling, during the, press, the process experimentation. It says, one by one, the cosmos decides to leave every perspective, turn it, it, turning it to present. This allows it to enjoy every expression generated by experience, becoming inspired in the energies that the experience creates. So this means that the universe itself starts to create these realities so it it, it 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 starts to experience in the present here and now each one of these expressions that it had created remember that the, that we in this for the coherence the coherence the goal along this whole year is to find a balance in each part of our self. The reason why we are doing this 
bringing the I am into the I here is because what we are doing is to download the information of the, the, the higher vibration into this world here and now. Hmm? One of the reasons why I'm doing this both Spanish and English uh, is because it's better for many people to have this at the, at the same moment. And also because um, what I want is for you to have my vibration. So I don't want the subtitles because I need to have the vibration itself. That's why I don't have subtitles. Remember that one of the things that we are doing is to download this information to change the energy of ourselves to open something new. So, of course, maybe, perhaps, you will be feeling some changes and for sure you will be feeling something uncomfortable because um, we are trying to take out our, to take ourselves out from the uh, comfort zone hmm? it's very common um, it's very uh, normal if you feel something uncomfortable in your body or with more energy than usual or more tired than usual this is because we are working uh, the changes of our body and of course who is not um, used to change in, in its daily life, of course, it will be bothering. So let's remember that these are not uh, meditation alignments to feel beautiful and connected with the universe and, and so on. So let's remember that this is a work for alignment and to work with the energy. So one of the things that um, what, what, why I am explaining this is because after some of the works that we do, suddenly people start to feel like they are they feel like uh, like persecuted or with energies that are uh, bad or they feel like scared or heavy or whatever, uh, and they then they say that it's because I am working with the darkness. And I want to make this clear and sure uh, about what is my job and why some people is feeling this. We have to remember that everything that we are doing is to change the perception of how we see the universe and to change ourselves, of course. And when we are working with this, it takes us outside of the feeling that, that we from the feeling we believe is being okay. And this is showing us in the outside as a projection, everything that we have within. So everything that like the fears, hate, everything that was within like trapped, they go away, they go outside. And this is why after an, an energetical work, a lot of darkness that was inside comes out. Hmm? And this is why we interpret it that outside there is something dark. We have to remember this. We are here for the I am. So working with this, we have to acknowledge that we are just a reflection of one tiny particle. So there is nothing outside we don't create first. So we have to remember that the perception that we have from the outside are exactly that, my perception. So it is my level of acknowledging, my level of vibration that allows me to see that. So if I start to feel something negative, it's because in my vibration, in my reality, was already there. So this is why we don't have to take all the energy that we think it's bad to the outside and get rid of it. What we have to do is to watch it, observe it, contemplate it, and understand why it is there and why am I looking at it. When I understand this, I integrate that darkness as a part of myself. And I am not scared anymore because I gave it a purpose. 
this is something that is very important to understand in order to see how we understand the world. We have to remember that nothing and no one can hurt you unless you allow it to hurt you. So recognizement and we have to understand this because we are going now to the core where all of that go through. Let's uh, sit in a comfortable position. Remember that the best position is like a tetrahedron, but um, uh, it's just a, a suggestion. It's not, um, it's not obligated to sit like that. The most important thing is that we are seated like this with the spine straight and our head pointing to the sky. So we look for a comfortable position. As you feel more comfortable, your hands, your arms, just let your body guide you to be comfortable. Someone is asking if there is a, a limit of age to do this. Uh, there is no age to do these alignments, but only if that other person ask for it and want to do it. Don't force anyone to do this unless they ask first. So um, whoever ever just uh, join us, joining this um, right now and hadn't uh, do the other ones, uh, I just recommend to take five minutes to just think about the other ones that you didn't do and all together in just five minutes just say the alignments, the mantras and that's it and then we keep moving. Let's begin. As always we begin doing a massage to the body, caressing the body, each part of it. So, we have to remember that touching the body before is to let the body know that we honor it and that we are doing this for it, downloading this information. I begin to relax my body. And just position your body slowly into a comfortable position relaxing your arm your legs your hands Breathe in through the nose. Breathe out through the nose. Very soft, no strong, no strength. Like if I am smelling a perfume. I just focus on my breathing. Breathe deep. I close my eyes, stop writing. I just focus on myself. I become aware of my whole body. I go with the air, the oxygen from the lungs to the heart, through all the blood, towards each muscle, each organ.
I recognize which part of my body right now is feeling more pain, is feeling uncomfortable, or pleasure. No judgment. I just picture that organ, that place. It can be a finger. I recognize this part of my body. I visualize its forms, its limits. I breathe very deep while observing it. I recognize right now in my body all the parts that feel more warm and the parts that feel more fresh. I become aware that the parts with more hot are places with a lot of energy and the cold parts they are a lack of energy. I recognize that wherever I feel much hot is a place where all the emotions are being stored right now. Without judgment. I allow myself to feel the first emotion that comes to me. I recognize it. I observe it. Breathe in very deep. And while you exhale, Take the first thought, idea that comes to your mind right now. No judgment. It can be anything. It can be something silly. I breathe in very deep. While I, am sir, I, well, I am observing this idea. With my hands or my imagination, I take this part of my body, this emotion and this idea as if they were spheres. I bring them in front of me to the high of my heart. I concentrate myself in each one of them. I observe them. I feel them. Without much effort, effort I just try to think about the connection in between the three of them. Try to understand why myself, my being, decided that these three tools are the ones to nourish my heart today. I read tools that I have today to nourish my heart. No judgment. It is the subconscious 
who makes this choice. I observe them. I order them. I become aware of each one of them. And when I do so, with my hands or my imagination, I bring them to the core of art. I become aware of the light of the I am. And being aware of it just through my breathing, I start to download the light through every one of the chakras in my head. Breathe in and observe the light coming to the crown chakra with the flower, the portal we had open. I fly descend to the indigo flower of my third eye. I feel the light of the I am coming down to the blue flower of my throat. And I project this light over the three spheres in my heart. I feel the heartbeat of my heart. I become aware as the sphere starts to melt and dissolve by the light about everything that is within it. I become aware of the emotions that are in my heart, like the fear, the sorrow, the guilty, I become aware of all the emotions and energies that push chest close in it. And I allow the light of the I am to dissolve this energy with the three years. I use the low vibration of my heart as fuel. As much light I can see in my heart. I see how the three spheres has been absorbed by the seed that is within my heart. So, with my sound, I activate the potential of this seed. Pronounce the vibration. I try to feel the sound E vibrating best in my heart as I pronounce it once and again.
as I pronounce it, I start to feel the seed, how it opens. I pronounce the vibration constantly until I feel how it opens, how it blossoms. feel as I pronounce and vibrate how the flower is opening with its beautiful color green emerald I feel my chest being lighted by the light of the I am and the color green. And I descend the power of the I am towards my heart. I can, I can, I can. I recognize that it is in my power to open the portal of my heart and to let all the low vibrations and emotions to stop being compressed and to expand in love. I can, I am love. With my deep breathing, I open the door. I am the portal. I am the portal of the heart. I am the portal of the heart. I breathe in deep and expand through my heart all the love that goes through this portal. And as I open my own portal of the heart, I start to feel to see all the other flowers, the green beautiful flowers in the network blossoming. I observe the pulses that connect us all as the echoes. I feel the energy of the I am open in to towards every direction from my heart. I recognize that the potential of the I am of the whole universe is manifested here and now through the portal of my heart. I can, I am the portal of the heart. I am love. I allow myself to feel how I am another pulse, another beat in the expansion of the heartbeat of the cosmos.
I bring my hands to my chest and I do such opening my heart very strong from the core with my hands I discharge the energy of my heart towards the rest of the body towards the earth I start to stretch my body, opening the chest, yawning, and make some caresses and massage to all your body. I open my eyes. I am here and now. Everyone good? To yawn is good to discharge all the rest of the energy. So yawn is good to let all the rest of the energy out. I hope it feels fine to download I am into the heart. We have so many other informations to download during the rest of the year. Remember to open the chest to allow the, this information to be downloaded. Okay? So uh, now rest, do something else, and see you tomorrow at the same time for the place. Have a good night. See you tomorrow.